hi everyone welcome to another video in this video i will show you how we can create or how we can achieve crude operation using web resources for example when i click this this is my account record and when i click this app employee i'm expecting it it should open all the existing contacts related contacts for this account as you can see uh, here it is showing four records because there are four uh, contacts which are associated with this account and uh, i want to create new contact for this account from this web resource from this pop-up so i have implemented this uh, ad employee if you click this it will ask you to provide new name let's say <coughs> i'm providing rakesh as new name and kumar age let's say last name and job title as ceo and click on ok as soon as i click ok the employee is created right it's because I have written the script to create this now to see you can see here the grid is not showing updated data if you click on refresh it will display the updated data right this record is created also if you go to the background and click on the contact it will also show you this record right this record is created in background in dataverse <coughs> so this is how so this is retrieving data and this is uh, creating new data using this add employee right and if you want to update let's say i want to update this uh, records job title then i can provide here let's say i want to update edge so i'm just updating only one field you can uh, take multiple fields as for your need so i want to update for this record only edge job on job title edge crm consultant click on update now it is updated it's still showing ceo just refresh it and it is updated right so retrieving we have done creating new record you have done add uh, employee updating existing record we have done and deleting let us understand delete so click on this i want to delete so you can select multiple to delete if you want because multiple selection is already available for operations i want to delete only this one so i can select and click on delete now delete process completed if you refresh then the new record is gone and here also the record is there if you refresh record is gone right now this is how you can achieve crude operation create to retrieve delete and update using web resources right now if you want to check the code if you have not so this is this part is a you know a consecutive or a second part of my last uh, uh, video i have already created this one open html web resource by button click so after uh, I, here i have uh, told you that how to open this because I am opening this uh, web resource right how this web web resource is opened by clicking button i have already uh, <coughs> explained in this video watch that video first and so that you can get that script then you can watch this one so that you can understand how this crude operation is done also i have created a blog if you want to uh, check if you want to get all the code that i have implemented in this crude operation right then also I have uh, stored the code here in the blog in my shopship.com site. If you go down, you can check that. Let me click blogs and here this one, right? So this is the crude operation. This both are interrelated. Okay. If you uh, completely uh, watch this and get the code, you can go to this crude operation. And if you open this blog also, you will see. Uh, the codes are available which code that i am writing i am using the codes are available here you can see here so this is the javascript code which opens the web resource html web resource and this is the code which is uh, used to generate this type of uh, crude operation things creating buttons creating text boxes you know uh, paging tables data tables and all that written here so take the code and uh, work on and if you have any uh, training requirements also you can let me know um, because uh, i'm managing trainings i'm delivering training in every month also you have any project uh, work also you can contact me okay. thank you guys i hope it helps see you next time bye